Reminder tonight of just how serious the sting of spring really is. For the first time this season, a bee attack takes a life, that of a beloved family pet. The bees swarm centered on three dogs in Salrita at a home near South Paseo Campo Verde and Rancho Salrita. All of them stung, one of them dead. Here is not in your sides, Maggie Vespa. That's right. Firefighters received the call shortly after six o'clock from this house on Camino to Nera. Three dogs being stung at this point. The bees were moving onto humans, so firefighters called in a local beekeeper to help them control the situation. He says he couldn't believe what he saw. I believe my exact phrase was "Holy cow!" <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I started pulling honeycomb, and then I got my flashlight, and I, once I got a piece of honeycomb removed, I could see back inside and it just kept going. McCracken says the hive located in the attic is about three feet wide and deep and eight feet long. It was likely growing there for years. He estimates 50,000 African honeybees nicknamed the killer bees, many of which he says swarmed and attacked the family's three dogs. Neighbors jumped in to help. And I saw the dogs trying to dig right under the gate trying to get out of the fence but they were in a swarm of bees all over and I and the bees started attacking me so I couldn't get close to them. Firefighters say the homeowners took all three dogs to a nearby veterinarian where one later died. The family who only suffered a few stings is staying with friends. They declined to go on camera. McCracken says to get the bees out he'll have to go in through the roof. It is too big of a job to do tonight. He estimates removing the hive will take at least four to six hours tomorrow morning. Reporting in Sauerita, I'm Maggie Vespa, KGUN 9 on your side.